Converting from an engineering bomb to a manufacturing bomb is an expensive headache. M-Bomb is designed to optimize engineering bombs for manufacturing. First, we start at CADLink, a tool for synchronizing your engineering bomb to the latest CAD model. Instead of saving directly to the ERP, we will store the engineering bomb in M-Bomb. Now, let's move over to M-Bomb. The engineering bomb option allows us to search through bombs created by CADLINK, while the manufacturing bomb option allows us to search through bombs previously saved in the M-Bomb application. Let's go ahead and open the engineering bomb we saved from CADLINK. Now, we are in the bomb view. This is the main interface of M-Bomb. The left pane displays the original engineering bomb. We can view the original structure of the bomb from CADLINK. The middle pane displays the bomb currently being modified. This is where we will create the manufacturing bomb. Parts and assemblies can be reorganized by drag and drop. They can also be routed to specific operations. We also have a drag and drop validation. MBOM prevents invalid changes, presenting us with a detailed message. This last pane displays part properties, as well as a preview of the part. We can modify part properties. Compare will query the ERP system for the current bomb and color code the manufacturing bomb corresponding to the changes that will be committed on save. The search bar at the top right allows us to search the manufacturing bomb as well as filter our searches by part types. We can pause the process using mbomb save to store our progress for now and come back later. This function does not push to ERP. The save button updates the bomb in the ERP and commits the changes. Reset is used to reset all alterations. This reverts any changes made to the manufacturing bomb and brings it back to its original state. 